Attorneys for former Fort Worth police officer Aaron Dean are now trying to use news coverage to show he would not get a fair trial in Tarrant County for the 2019 shooting death of a Tatiana Jefferson. Dean is charged with murder. His attorneys say the saturation of publicity is a reason to move the trial out of Tarrant County. The defense is presenting now hours and hours of news coverage as evidence. Fox 4's Macy Jenkins joins us now from Fort Worth with more. Macy. Hi, Heather. Well, we did not get a decision on that change of venue motion today. Like you said, we heard more than 100 uh, different video clips, all including media coverage that stretches back to October 12th, 2019, the date of the shooting of a Tatiana Jefferson. One of the defense attorneys says that they pulled clips, videos that were attached to news articles, um, all of them mentioning in some form or other of uh, mentioning Aaron Dean or a Tatiana Anna Jefferson, of course, their aim to show that there's been so much media coverage of this case that it would be impossible for Dean to get a fair trial. Former Fort Worth police officer Aaron Dean back in a Tarrant County courtroom for a pre-trial hearing four months after his trial was originally scheduled to begin. Defense, your motion, call your first witness. Dean is charged with murder for the October 2019 shooting death of a Tatiana Jefferson. Police say he was responding to a non-emergency call from a neighbor about a door that was open overnight at the home of Jefferson's mother. Body camera video showed Dean firing shots through a window from outside, hitting Jefferson as she held a gun. Dean's attorneys filed a motion to move the trial out of Tarrant County, alleging he would not receive a fair trial due to the extensive media coverage. Dean is currently in custody facing a murder charge. That coverage took center stage on Monday. Somewhere between 300 and 350 people were allowed inside of the building tonight. The defense played more than 100 local and national news clips from the last two and a half years, including 25 from Fox 4. Dean's body camera video from the shooting was featured in several of the reports. Officer draws a weapon. Also played the non-emergency call from James Smith. He's the neighbor who called police around 2.20 in the morning after noticing a door had been left open. Additional video included past interviews with Jefferson's sisters and friends and press conferences with now former Fort Worth Mayor Betsy Price and then Fort Worth Police Chief Ed Kraus. There's absolutely no excuse for this incident. And the person responsible will be held accountable. A judge has issued a gag order for this trial. While Jefferson's relatives are unable to comment, they were visibly frustrated after seeing the many news reports shown in court. Dean remains out on bond. Yeah, I had a reaction to watching those videos today. No comment. His trial was delayed back in January due to the unavailability of expert witnesses. The defense now requesting another continuance, claiming illness is keeping lead attorney Jim Lane from preparing for the trial and that they need more time to analyze recently received data. Now, just before court adjour adjourned this evening, the defense introduced three additional thumb drives containing more than five hours of footage. That will be shown tomorrow. If the judge denies this change of venue, then the jury selection will begin next Monday, with the trial beginning the Monday after that.